Hey, my beautiful Leo. So I'm back. I do apologize. I had a family emergency that I had to deal with um, because I was the next to kin and all that stuff. So I'm back. Um, so I will be back tomorrow as well. Back every day. So I am on it now, Leos. Please forgive me. Give me a like, a share, a subscribe if you like this video. So I'm diving straight in with the affirmation cards. Oh my Leo, see what affirmation you need today. Let's have a look. Nobody wants to give you one. <laughs> Make the rest of your laugh the best of your laugh. Make the rest of your laugh the best of your laugh. What do you need to do in order to create the best laugh? Live in your best laugh. So, let's get you on from the numerology deck. Why do I feel like I always need drums? Or music. I feel like there's something missing <laughs> when I'm doing these. Right, so numerology wise, we have Prad coming out in numerology, the number 19. Make the rest of your laugh the best of your laugh. So, Prad is not a sin. I said that in one of the readings. Sometimes we have to keep our pride in touch, sometimes we have to turn it down a notch. Sometimes we have to turn it up a notch and be proud of ourselves for our achievements. So wherever you link in with that, wherever it resonates with you, be proud of yourself. Always be proud of yourself. So I'm using the Psychic Tarot Oracle deck for the free card reading for my Leos. So we have Love Begins. We've got the Ace of Cups. So in the recent past, we've got the Ace of Cups energy. You could be dealing with Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Something may have happened. The last uh, water energy was Scorpio, uh, October, November. Um, but it's about being around people and it's about you being able to pour from your own cup, being with people that pour from the similar cup, the same cup, that type of thing. New beginnings, new streams, your cup runneth over. So there's something to celebrate. You know, it's like this is a stepping stone to be able to make the best laugh for me i feel like you have got to be proud of yourself you know it could be a new relationship it could be something you've done something you've brought to the table but i feel like you have done something in the past to be proud of yourself so at present we've got the third eye chakra love it your third eye chakra is opening leo your third eye chakra is showing you the bigger picture of everything so i feel like then that in itself helps with this affirmation make the rest of your life the best of your life it's almost like you've had this epiphany moment and it's like i've lived through that i've done this i've done that i just want to be happy no matter what it is that brings me what brings you happiness because i feel like that is what you're questioning but i feel like your third eye is actually showing you the things that you thought were going to bring you happiness aren't the things that are bringing you the happiness you know, a lot of people think, I need loads of money, I need to be able to do this, to do that, to this. But if we had millions in the bank and we never had to work to achieve anything, that is not bringing happiness. That's bringing laziness. That's bringing, you, you don't see the things in the same way as if it was just there. You know, we're not grateful for them experiences. So I feel like you're grateful for the journey that you've been on in order to find those things and achieve those things. So you are working on the vibration of the number six as well. Peace, love, harmony and balance. Oh, because going forward, you're dropping into your heart, Leo. I absolutely love this reading. So the heart is that, that zero point energy. The heart is the, the heart of all manifestation. And when we can drop into our heart... It's almost like you know what, what's making you feel happy. When it comes from the heart, not the head, not the gut, this is happiness, this is love, this is anything that brings that energy to yourself. It's almost like I want to give you a massive cuddle or I feel like you're just so lovable at the moment, Leo. You're dropping into the heart energy. It's all about being proud of what you've achieved. That is definitely this energy. So get some clarification your venus is open to new offers now so always check your sun moon your rising and your venus if you don't know that go and look at your natal chart it's really easy to do just google natal chart um and always check your sun moon rising and your venus but your venus rules finances and relationships and it is open to new offers so it could be financial it could be love your venus sign is playing a massive part on top of the third eye, we've got memories and nostalgia. It's almost like you, you're realising, you're going back into the past, but you're not sat there thinking, I want that back. Or It's almost like I've come from there and now I'm here. 
you know that is what i'm getting with that the third eye chakra is open so that you can see those memories for what they truly were so the heart chakra energy when it wants to cut wow sun strength and empowerment you are working with your own empowerment be proud of yourself leo roll out the lion you are i love that and i'll be back tomorrow